board the Marmoset, a French fishing trawler steered by Olivier. He's been a skipper for 30 years and often casts his net in British waters. Britain's seas are among the most fish rich in the world. A treasure shared among European fishermen, yea, mostly fishers in the Channel, the sea that separates northern France and southern England. I spent 60 to 70 percent of my time in British waters. France is here, and the United Kingdom is on this side. I'm about in the middle. You can see here, that's my boat, and the borderline is in green. So, obviously, if, after Brexit, us French are kicked out of British waters, I'll lose 70% of my profit. Basically, I'll go bankrupt. Since 1983, boats from across the EU have been fishing freely in one another's economic exclusive zones. When Britain leaves the EU, this zone, which stretches 200 nautical miles from the coastline, will no longer be European. If Britain restricts access, European vessels could lose more than half of their catch. French fishermen would lose the most money, 170 million euros a year. Fish caught by us, it was caught in British waters. In a cruel irony, Olivier and his nephew signed for their new trawler just before Britain voted to leave the EU. The Marmose cost two and a half million euros. After 72 hours of fishing, the Marmose arrives home in Boulogne. This is the busiest fishing port in France. 65% of the catch comes from British waters. With Brexit looming, it's on borrowed time.